Everything we do in our lives is somehow connected to the use of modern technologies. Modern technologies have a significant impact on people's lives. A new unified world culture is being created in which traditions and distances are no longer important. The mission of technology is to create a world where everyone can live better and easier. Today we will tell you about the most relevant news from the world of future technologies. We will discuss the new Chinese quantum computer that has reached an unprecedented perfection, the robot dog named Spot, which can autonomously open doors. We will also talk about NASA's future prospects for moon colonization, as the space agency calls for accepting the idea that a manned moon landing in 2025 is unlikely. We won't forget to mention the new batch of Tesla electric cars with steering wheel issues, the world's speed record set by the Tesla Model S played, and Porsche's presentation of the new Mission X electric hypercar concept. You are on the Caro Show channel. Enjoy watching. The rise of the machines is getting closer. Chinese scientists have reported achieving another significant milestone in the development of quantum computing. The quantum computer Zhuzhang was able to perform tasks that are commonly used in artificial intelligence models 180 million times faster than the most powerful supercomputer. Just think about that number. For the first time, they used a quantum computer to execute and accelerate two algorithms, random search and model hardening, that are commonly used in artificial intelligence. The fastest classical supercomputer in the world would require 700 seconds to process each of 200,000 data samples, almost five years to complete the task. However, Zhuzhang completed completed the same task in less than one second. It uses light as a means of computation. Unlike other quantum computers, it doesn't require extremely low temperatures and can maintain stability for longer periods. It is the first among quantum computers to achieve the so-called quantum supremacy, meaning its ability to solve problems inaccessible to classical computing machines. In 2020, Zhuzhang completed a task that would have taken the supercomputer two and a half billion years in just 200 seconds. In general, the Chinese once again demonstrate to the world that they cannot perform any country in terms of technology development. Let's move on to other news. The well-known company Boston Dynamics has released some very interesting updates for their famous yellow robot dog, Spot. Used as an autonomous tool for inspection and exploration, Spot can now perform its tasks even more efficiently. Most of the updates will be beneficial for those who use the robot to perform scheduled inspections at industrial plants. Spot will not only take pictures from analog sensors, but also record its own readings using computer vision. It will be able to share the resulting data, even in the absence of the internet. Previously, to enter a room with a closed door, Spot required a human operator to control its manipulator. This meant that for autonomous patrolling of facilities, Spot always needed supervision, or doors had to be intentionally left open. However, in the near future, Boston Dynamics plans to equip the robots with an articulated handle that will allow them to open doors autonomously. For now, the robot dog is still in the process of mastering these skills. Among other things, Spot's ability to track temperature has also been improved. With the help of thermal imaging cameras, it can now alert in case of equipment overheating or extreme temperature drops, as well as detect invisible air and gas leaks in high-pressure systems. The company has also implemented a new audio-visual and visual notification system, allowing the robot to communicate its presence and intentions. As an additional feature, Spot will have five lights that will flash green during standard tasks, yellow to caution users, for example, when climbing stairs or crossing busy areas, and finally, white to indicate data collection for inspection. To completely stop the work of Spot, users will have to press the emergency stop button. In this case, the robot will lie on the floor and the lights will flash red. Furthermore, the developers also taught the four-legged assistant to move better on slippery surfaces by adding a new gait, where it takes slow steps forward, restricting movement to one leg at a time while lowering its body closer to the ground for better balance. As for other news, the initial plans to land humans on the moon in 2024 were later changed to 2025, and now the plans are gradually shifting to 2026. The delay in the moon landing is due to the unsuccessful tests of SpaceX's Starship rocket. The first orbital prototype of Starship exploded just minutes after liftoff. Sending humans on this rocket will require many test flights, taking much more time than originally planned. The lunar landing is planned as part of the Artemis 3 mission, which is expected to be a complex operation. Astronauts will fly 
tied to the moon's orbit in the Orion spacecraft on the SLS rocket, which also faced several issues and experienced delays of over six months. However, the Starship spacecraft by Elon Musk's SpaceX is intended to depart for the moon. The ship will head to the moon and deploy a lunar landing module on the moon's surface. The astronaut crew will transfer to the lunar module in orbit, followed by the Starship's landing on the moon's surface. Such a complex route, with many intermediate stages, raises doubts about its feasibility. SpaceX will not only need to test the Starship by launching it into orbit, but also send it to the moon without crew to demonstrate the safety of such an operation. Additionally, the company will have to create an orbital infrastructure for refueling the rocket to enable its journey to the moon's orbit. However, SpaceX still doesn't have a fully functional flying Starship rocket for this purpose. We will monitor the further developments and hope that the mission will still take place. Last year, the Tesla Model Y electric crossover received the highest score from the European New Car Assessment Program for safety evaluation. However, in light of recent news, it seems that owners of this model may not feel completely safe after all. It has been discovered that the steering wheel of the vehicle can simply detach. According to the available information, a steering wheel fastener may not be sufficiently tightened, causing it to detach while driving. Tesla has decided to recall a large number of Model Y vehicles due to safety concerns. Tesla has come to the conclusion that the potential problem could be in cars manufactured between January 1, 2022 and March 25, 2023. The company will inspect the recalled vehicles and, if necessary, tighten the fastening. Owners of affected vehicles will be notified by mail. Some more news about Tesla. The Model S in the plaid configuration set a new record for the fastest lap time among production electric cars at the famous Nürburgring racetrack. Elon Musk's car managed to beat the previous leader, the Porsche Taycan Turbo S by several seconds. The American company's electric car completed the approximately 20.8-kilometer track in 7 minutes and 25 seconds, which is about 8 seconds faster than the previous record set by the Porsche Taycan Turbo S last year. Interestingly, during the race, the Tesla Model S played had a traditional round steering wheel, unlike the Formula One racing cars with a steering yoke, which users found extremely inconvenient in practice. The Model S played used the latest generation of new tires and brakes for the track run. The electric car can reach speeds of over 320 km per hour, with a top speed of 288 km per hour achieved on the track. Now the question arises, how will the Germans respond to such an audacious move? And the Germans will respond with an even bolder move. On its 75th anniversary celebration, Porsche decided to unveil the new Mission X concept, which the company is ready to turn into the fastest mass-produced electric car, provided there is demand. The Porsche Mission X concept was first revealed on June 8, on the eve of the 100th anniversary of the 24 Hours of Le Mans race. The concept features a carbon body reminiscent of the 959 Carrera GT and 918 Spider, but its standout feature is the forward and upward opening doors with glass sections extending to the roof. Information about the powertrain of the show car has not been disclosed, but it is estimated to have 1 horsepower per 1 kilogram of weight. The downforce will reach 408 kilograms at 200 kilometers per hour and 860 kilograms at 285 kilometers per hour. Mission X is known to use a 900-volt system, enabling it to recharge the battery from 5% to 80% capacity in just 10 minutes. This is about twice as fast as the Taken Turbo S. In the press release, Porsche also makes it clear that the Mission X in its production incarnation will be able to set a new record for the northern loop of the track in the German Nürburgring among electric vehicles approved for road use. Write in the comments what impressed you the most in this video, the new Chinese supercomputer, the new concept from Porsche, or perhaps the updated version of Spot the Robot. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the Karo Show channel. Also check out our previous videos. See you later.